guys, welcome to another episode of Jungle Travels. Look at this, how pretty is all this? You know, if you've been watching my videos, you will remember that I said I'm going to be on the hunt around Christmas for the most chocolatey chocolate locked village I can find. Hi, well, I'm going to start this hunt in a little place, it's quite dear to me, a little place called Dog Cross. Now, I'm not going to turn the camera on me too much because it's quite dark and I'm not sure how much of this you're going to see. So I'm going to turn it onto Dog Cross. I think Dog Cross is no surprise for going all out at Christmas, where the whole village just seems to be in competition with each other as to who can make it most Christmassy. But I think they all deserve a prize. Ever since I was a kid, this has been going on and this is the one place to me that makes me feel like Christmas. Whether it's snowing or whether it's not snowing, I think this place is just awesome. There's the old Saddleworth Bank. I mean, look at this, everybody goes all out. Look how stunning it is. It's very rare that you find a little village that goes to such trouble. There's the monument, which believe it or not, a month ago, that monument was actually knocked down. Some, uh, how should we say, some idiot in a 40 foot wagon tried turning a 40 foot wagon around that corner and took the monument down with it. So, you know, well done to the council for actually getting the monument back up in time for Christmas. And working. But yeah, this to me just... I love it, it's just great. Everybody just goes and puts up decorations and lights and all sorts. Look how wonderful it is. Everywhere you look, every little nook and cranny. You just see little decorations everywhere. Santa Claus there. Uh, what have we got there? Oops. People going past in the car. A nice little train in the window, look at that. Look how awesome that train is. And we've got robins in the nesting box. I like the train, that's cool. Yeah. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you guys too. Merry Christmas Dog Cross for going all over. That little silhouettes going on, Christmas trees, toys in baskets, that's nice. It's marvellous, isn't it? There's the swan. I was going to go in there and have a pint, but I've got no cash on me. There's a little note on the door saying cash only. So. Yeah. Holograms, that's what I was looking for. Holograms, that's the word, holograms. But yeah, so not a big video today, just a short one to show you what I think is marvellous. Dog cross. See, even down there. Walk round. So you got the village square here, where the lights up all the tree and everything. A few people over there chatting away. A couple of local yokels. Yes, so oh, there you go. Little dog cross. So yeah, I think everybody has a place. I think everybody has a place that brings home Christmas to them. I can actually smell wood fires in the air as well, which is really nice. 
real wood fires. Yeah, everybody has a place that brings home Christmas to them. And for me, that place is here. Dobcross. Look at that. What have we got here? Little reindeers. Little robins, trees. There's a snowman waving at us. Yeah. Anything around the corner here? Oh, people. Ah. Santa's on a tree. Very nice. It's just a quaint little village's dog cross. See, everywhere you look, there's little, little bits of Christmas going on. What have we got down here? There you go. Uh, not quite as much as what's in the, uh, the square. Yeah. There's a few going on up there. Not too much. So yeah. So not a big, not a big video today, guys. I just wanted to show you my little taste of Christmas. The little place that always brings home Christmas to me. I've been to the Christmas markets, as you saw in my video. And that's just commercial crap in it. I'm not really into the Christmas markets. I mean, I like them, but it's not the same, is it? But this to me, long before I ever used to go to the Christmas markets, was always Dove Cross. Dove Cross just got that special feeling inside you at Christmas. I hope you all agree. I hope you all like it. What do you reckon? There you go. So there you go. A little trip through Dob Cross. Like I say, not a big video, just a short one. Just thought I'd share this little piece of paradise with you. Hope you've all enjoyed it. If you haven't, a bloody humbug to you. Cheer up your miserable sorts. It's Christmas. Anyway. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be on the hunt for Christmassy chocolate box villages, but I don't think anything's going to compare to Dob Cross. And to be honest, even if I did find something that compared to it, I think Dog Cross would still be the one for me. So, on that bombshell, I'm going to say thanks for watching, guys, and uh, catch up with you in the next one. Taddy Bye's.